Welcome back to Upper Michigan today, everybody. If you've got a cup of tea that you're sipping on, cheers to cheers. you. Cheers, Justin. Yes, of course. Yeah, this is a young mountain tea. It's very earthy, kind of grassy. I love that kind of sweet, grassy flavor oh, that sub tea offers. So like, that's delicious. What I, <laughs> I love so much about matcha. And yeah. you know, this hot tea is really nice um, yes. inside on an in an air conditioned room like this. But you know, <laughs> yeah. we are getting into summertime, mm -hmm. temperatures are warming up, yeah. and uh, uh, Marquette Cafe has a lineup of cool drinks for all those tea lovers. So Blossom Bird Bubble Tea offers a variety of bubble teas from classic milk teas to fruity lemonades. And it's been open in Marquette now since 2021. Owners Daniel and Caleb Ball um, also offer a small bakery and display of pop culture toys and collectibles. Um, and this summer they have some exciting plans lined up for the community. So let's check this out. Can't wait. Blossom Bird Bubble Tea is a cafe, a small bakery, and a collectibles toy shop. Everything about the business is stuff that we love. You know, we're fans of Japanese pop culture, anime, video games, stuff like that. And it just so happens that there are a ton of other people in the community that enjoy these same things. So bubble tea is a Taiwanese drink. It originated in Taiwan in the 1980s. Um, so it's, it's mainly a milk tea. Milk tea has, you know, been around forever. But what makes bubble tea different from that are the tapioca pearls at the bottom of the drink. The boba, as it's called. I always like to say it's a drink that you also chew. Um, and it's just tons of customization options. By far, our most popular flavor of drink is the taro milk tea with the brown sugar tapioca pearls. It comes off as like a subtle, nutty, vanilla flavored drink. One of our special drinks, the tiger milk tea, that's a classic bubble tea drink that almost any boba shop has. It's a brown sugar syrup flavored black tea with milk, the classic tapioca pearls. So we not only offer milk teas, but we have iced teas and lemonades. And one of my favorite summertime drinks is the honeydew melon flavored lemonade with strawberry popping boba. Shop Local by UP Downtown Marquette is adding a unique eatery to the area. Blossom Bird Bubble Tea Shop and Bakery will be opening this summer. Bubble tea is my whole life in the back of my head, I always had opening up a bubble tea shop as a backup plan if I didn't figure out what I really wanted to do as a career. My wife, Kayla and I, the COVID pandemic really helped push us away from our hometown. We just, you know, we, we had the funds necessary to, to pick up and start somewhere new. Kayla was the one that really pushed me to pull the trigger on opening up a bubble tea shop. So it was about in February of 2021 is when we really decided to give this a try. And then we ended up opening in August of 2021. We, we first envisioned this as just a small little bubble tea cafe where we might have 10, 15, 20, 30 customers a day. And the very first day that we opened that, the line out the door down the street blew the lid off of that plan. So luckily we had Kayla's parents and sister coming to visit us on the first day. And they ended up working behind the counter with us. <laughs> and ever since then, our, our team has just been growing. And that has allowed both Kayla and I to, to bring other aspects to the business. So she's been uh, growing the bakery portion. We have a set schedule for our macarons. They're available on the weekends. Um, those have been a huge hit. And we're planning on soon in the next few weeks having pastry items every day during the week. Kayla has a real passion for uh, making vintage style cakes. Um, so from time to time, she opens up custom cake orders um, on our website and you can request a custom cake. Then I've been able to focus on our collectible toys section. I feel like we definitely brought in a, a community within a community. 
you know, an easy label to put on it is the nerd community. Um, and I would like to give a shout out uh, to my friend Joel Siegel. Um, he created a group called Nerds of Marquette. We're showing the classic Studio Ghibli film, Spirited Away, at Thomas Theater on July 13th at 7 p.m. We're gonna have a special drink, and Four Swords Retro Pub is gonna have some special treats to go along with the movie event too, so we can't wait for that. From the beginning, our goal was to stitch our own thread in the fabric of the community, and I feel like we are achieving that. Well, it's definitely a nice drink to have on a hot summer day, but you know, hot tea is always a great thing in my opinion. Yeah. We are still here with Raj of Young Mountain Tea. We're going to be diving more into his products, where you can find it, and how best to enjoy it. We'll be right back. <laughs>